Ludwig van Beethoven was one of the greatest musical geniuses of all time. But most people don't know that his life was filled with tragedy and sorrow. As a musician, of all your senses, which would be the cruelest to lose? Perhaps the greatest tragedy Beethoven ever had to deal with was when he began losing his hearing at the peak of his career. He was born into a musical family. His father was a court musician and a music teacher, but he began to drink heavily. Because of his addiction, he began slowly losing his voice and his social status, making it difficult for him to earn for a living. Because of his unfulfilled dreams, he projected his own failed career on his son and took over his music career, and he was a very harsh teacher. Whenever Beethoven played poorly, he would yell how he was an embarrassment to the family. Beethoven was punished for the slightest mistake. His father would even lock him in a cellar. Beethoven also had a hard time in school. He was probably dyslexic. Despite the complex music he was composing from a very early age, he allegedly couldn't multiply and couldn't divide, and also had trouble spelling. Even in his musical studies, he gave an impression that he wasn't very smart. Can you believe that one of his early teachers said, as a composer, he's hopeless? because his father was drinking heavily. At the age of 16, after his mother died, Beethoven had to drop out of school and take care of the family. The loss of his mother hurt him deeply. She was his best friend. But sadly, he had no time for mourning. To put food on the table, he had to give private music lessons to anyone who would hire him. His love life was not very happy either. He fell in love with few of the young women he was giving private lessons to, but because he wasn't born into wealth, he was seen as not good enough and was never able to marry the one he loved. But perhaps the greatest tragedy Beethoven ever had to deal with was when he began to lose his hearing at the age of 28. He became completely deaf by the time he was 44. For a man whose whole life was music, this was truly devastating. He was given such an amazing gift, but that gift had an expiration date. But despite his deafness, he never stopped composing. It is so inspiring how he never gave up on his talent. During his lifetime, he wrote over 700 compositions. Even his greatest ones came from a time of tragedy and pain. Even a complete deafness could not steal away the music that was within him. His music is so revolutionary because it was about what it was like to be Beethoven, what it was like to be human. So, What's your story?